Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. This one is my first video after the demonstration of blood bank management system project. If you don't see that demonstration video, just go to the description and check out the link I provided there. So in this video, I'm going to create a just a login part of that project. So let us start. First, we need to create a new project here. And for now we are clicking next. And here we are renaming as blood bank management system for clicking on finish uh, it will take a little bit of time to create okay so you can see that this one is created now first we have to create a jframe whose name is login here login login finish and we have to set the size first 1366 comma 768 my screen size okay after that we have to design the form okay for that we are taking level 1 level 2 for that okay after that we are taking a text field for the username and after that we also need a text field here uh, sorry text field no password field here okay now now we have to edit text user name and then another one is remove this text and increasing the size to the uh, 250 okay and the text remove this and we are also setting to 250 and the next one is password password okay after that we are increasing the size of both username and password to the bold 14 setting to the bold 14 clicking on ok close this application and we are also increasing the fields size okay here making it as bold 14 clicking on ok close and here we also need uh, buttons here button 1 and button 2 and is it text login log n okay and then another one is for the close close okay now now we also need to increase the size of this login and close button so making it as bold bold 14 okay and we also need to change the color of this fields so here I'm pin here uh, background color I am setting it to this one there you can see this clicking on ok close now we also need to set the icons in this project you can see that for the login and close button so I am directly going to copy this icon in our file if you need this icon just go to the description I already provided the link and you can directly download from there okay after that copying it just come here and paste it to here you can see there uh, every icon has been pasted here I am directly going to use it right click on this properties and here I have to select login login okay and close this and after that for the close we are selecting the icon exit application name okay let me here write here exit application for the close okay now you can see here our form has been created now we have to first remove this uh, min max or close button from our j frame so for here just click here undecoded and close it okay now we have to change this layout to the absolute layout so that we can insert image in the background of this form so now we are inserting a label here right click on this properties and here i am inserting an icon all uh, login 
background background final you can see that close okay now resize to the this okay it's perfectly fit and now we have to move this form to here for that first we need to minimize this all okay now uh, let me close the output also just select this all login and all and here i just placed it okay now you can see that our form has been designed our uh, front end is designed it's time to write the code for the back end so for that first we need to move to the close so event action action performed and here we have to write int a so we have to ask uh, for the confirmation so here int a and here we are uh, option j option j option okay j option and dot show confirmation show show confirmation dialog okay confirmation dialog okay now you can see that and after that we have to set null at first and first we need to do this and here i'm writing the message do you really really want to close application okay okay after that we have to add select select at the header or you can say the name of that pop up message and after that we have to set the options like we it having yes or no option no? that's why we are choosing a yes no option in it okay and if the user select yes it means that the value of uh, a is equals to 0 okay so in that condition it will system dot exit will be called uh, we are writing the system dot exit basically the system exit works as it close uh, it shut down your jvm so that application will get closed okay now uh, now we have to write the codes for the login here i'm not not using any database i'm directly um, code uh, save as username as bbms blood man man management system and the password as admin because this one is a windows based application so here we don't need that okay if j text field one dot get text get text dot equals equals to bbms bbms blood bank management system and j password password one dot get text dot equals equals okay uh, to the admin okay it means that this one is password is correct okay we also need to create a home page so i'm just creating a new home page here jframe home in next video i will show you about home page how i just created the home page okay so i'm just in this video i'm just going uh, to, for the logging part so here we are writing set visible means we are hiding the this page so here we are setting false okay and after that we are setting the new visible new home okay dot set visible it's true okay after that else condition let's say like uh, the password or username does not match with this uh, B bbms and uh, password is admin then it will show that incorrect incorrect user name or password it will show the pop-up message okay now 
our login part has been completed let me run this file it will take take few seconds to run okay now here you can see that username and password let me first write the incorrect username bm and the password we are taking anything and we click on login you can see a pop-up message has been opened incorrect username or password let me click on ok and now bbms blood bank management system and let me write the password admin ok let me click on login login you can see that the next frame has been opened this one is our home page ok say that okay so this is all about the login page okay in the next video i'm going to create for the home page okay so if you if you need a image or icons of this project just go to description i already provided the link you can directly download it so this is all about our login page i hope you guys like this video so please hit like and subscribe my channel thank you